lakini as you are doing that hata wakati ulikuwa unafanya namna hiyo and you have seen very many leaders who have been mad slinging you and talking badly warming up to your government we are also seeing another side by their leadership they are blowing hot and cold pande hii unafanya effort ya kuongea na wale viongozi ambao walikuwa mlengo wengine ndio wakuja kwa serikali tuunde pamoja pande nyingine viongozi wao wanasema sawa twendeni tukifanya kazi na serikali then all of a sudden wanasema tutafanya maandamano your excellency we are reading in between the lines because saa nyingine we could be focusing could be focusing the wrong people atuelewe kwa nini wakati kiongozi wa upinzani ametoka nje akiwa huko nje naongea mambo ya hapa na kuna wengine unakutana hapo wakifanya wakifanya fununu vile wata sponsor maandamano mimi i think is a decoy kwa sababu haiwezekani kwamba azimio ilikuwa imetengenezwa na mlengo mmoja wa siasa kuna mlengo mwingine ya siasa ambaye they are within us and we are not looking your excellency we need to start looking at them and i want to thank you the deputy president because the other day on thursday you called the leaders who were elected by jubilee party who and those who did not make it to try and reconcile them with us which is a good effort and we're going to work with them i was talking to one of them here and we are saying we need to unite because now the politics are behind us lakini viongozi wao and i'm falling short of naming them the way sis limbarire governor said angalia ile mlengo mwingine wachana na kuangalia tinga peke yake iko wengine ambao tutaki kutaja kwa sababu hao ndio wanachochea wanasema we have not gotten what you want the, the way you are heading we will not get there and you know what they are looking for because this is a this a, a tactic in war your excellency that says advance while negotiating they are trying to negotiate with you while they are advancing towards war which is unnecessary because unajua wezi tishwa kwa hivyo we need to read between the lines what are they looking for ukiguza ibc wanaleta shida there is a possibility they don't want the ibc to be formed according to the law they want to be involved outside the law we would like you to ignore that your excellency and focus on what what is supposed to be done according to the law sisi tukio hapa kwa viongozi wa mount kenya uh, in general yote east na west tutataka kuhakikisha tuko nyuma yako all the way and we're looking forward to you coming to the other counties including the rakanidi so that we can continue giving thanks and we can continue uniting our people of the east otherwise tuko ngangari tuko na wewe na hao wote wanatajwa kina smith kina yule mwingine alikuwa na blue wisu naitwa gedhongo na na kioni wao tumewaonea itini kwa sababu tunajua sababu yao hawana haja na wakenya waendelee mbele they want to sabotage you and we won't tell you ignore them at not at their own risk but at our benefit thank you very much and god bless you